Welcome back, guys. So we're moving on to our operations with matrices. Now, um, we'll be looking at three operations: addition, subtraction, and multiplication. There is no division in matrices, and we'll talk about it. Um, then we actually get to it. Now, let's quickly discuss addition, subtraction. So, whenever you're adding um, or subtracting two or more matrices, the matrices need to have the same order. If they do not have the same order, you cannot perform addition or subtraction. I'm only talking about the first two operations, addition and subtraction. The matrices which are being added or subtracted need to have the same order. Now, um, let's say that I have three matrices here, A, B, and C. So the order of matrix A is um, two by two because two rows and two columns. B also has two by two. And C is um, one by two because one row and two columns. Now the first thing I wanna do is find A plus B. So how do I do that? I write matrix A. 2, 5, minus 1, 0. I write all the values plus B, which is minus 3, 9, 7, and 1. Now, look very carefully. How do you add these matrices? You add them by adding the corresponding terms. The first term here adds to the first term here. The next term here adds to the next term here, and so on and so forth. So it would simply be um, 2 plus minus 3, minus 1 plus 7, 5 plus 9, and 0 plus 1. And all of these terms still remain independent of each other. 2 plus minus 3, this becomes minus. 2 minus 3 is minus 1. Minus 1 plus 7 is positive 6. 9 plus 5 is um, 14. 0 plus 1 is 1. I was going to write one like this. Yeah. So, and I've written this. Sorry. Yeah. Um, so, this is how you add the three matrices. Now, um, one thing to note here is when you're adding or subtracting matrix, they need to have the same order, and the answer that you get also needs to have the same order as the matrices. Now, moving on to part B, A plus C. Now, you can't do A plus C. Why? Because A and C have a different order, which means you cannot add or subtract A plus C. So, this is not applicable or not possible. Moving on to the last part, um, A minus B. So that would be 2, minus 1, 5, 0. I've written A. This is matrix A. There is a minus here. And then B is minus 3, 7, 9, and 1. So what you're going to do here is 2 minus minus 3. 2 minus minus 3. Why are the two minuses? Because um, 1 minus is here and 1 minus is over here. And then it would be um, a minus 1, minus 7, 5, minus 9, and 0, minus one. So um, this would then be, I'm just going to write the answer here, um, that's plus, so 2 plus 3 is 5, minus 1 minus 7 is minus 8, 5 minus 9 is minus 4, and 0 minus 1 is minus 1. So this was A minus B. Let's look at a slightly different example. Let's say that I have these matrices same again, um, A, B, and C. I want to now find 2A. Now this simply means a scalar multiplication. What do I mean by that? The entire matrix A is being multiplied by 2. So what you do in this case is that you multiply each value inside matrix A by 2. Why am I multiplying it by 2? Because it says 2A. If it were written Uga Booga Booga A, I would be multiplying each value in A by Uga Booga Booga. So this would now be 2 times 2 is 4, 2 times minus 1 is minus 2, 2 times 5 is 10, 2 times 0 is 0. So that is your um, 2a complete. Now the next part is 2a minus 3b. So I've already calculated 2a, which is um, 4, 10, minus 2, and 0. I've written that in place of 2a. Now for mi minuses as it is. Now for 3b, I need to multiply the vector, the, the, the matrix um, uh, b by 3. So it's minus 3, 9, 7, and 1. Now, I need to multiply this first before I solve it. So, this should be um, 3 times. Uh, I, also, I'm going to keep the minus here. I am just multiplying each value in the matrix B by 3 first. So, this becomes minus 9. 3 times 7 is um, 3 times seven is 21. Then multiply 3 with 9. 3 nines are um, 27. And then multiply um, 3 with this 1, which would be 3. So now I've multiplied and now I have to perform my operation which is subtraction, minus 2 and 0. 
So this becomes four minus minus nine, which is simply four plus nine, um, and that gives me thirty. Minus two minus twenty one that gives me minus twenty two. Um, ten minus twenty seven gives me minus seventy, and zero minus three gives me minus three. So that is your answer for part B. Um, and that is how we add or subtract. So for addition and subtraction, I need to have the same order. Uh, between two or more than two matrices. Um, if they do not have the same order, you cannot add or subtract them. Um, secondly, whenever you have any number you multiply with the matrix, you multiply each value in the matrix by that value. Um, that's it, guys. Um, keep learning. Goodbye. Take care.